nice heavy head on the table, just let it relax. We're just coming in here, nice and easy. Good. Wow. Don't twist around, stay right there. Why'd you say wow? Because the noise, the pain, the what? Just both, crazy? Both, yeah. <laughs> don't, no, no, don't help. No. Yeah, you, your problem is that you gotta relax, mm -hmm. okay? If you get all tense, you're gonna undo my work. So you just gotta relax, okay? Good, okay. don't help. Mm -hmm. there it is. No, don't help. You keep helping. Don't help, okay? Because the more you help, the more you undo my work. Okay, you gotta relax. It's gonna be really hard for you to figure this out, but we're gonna work on it, okay? Okay, let it go. Good. Oh my god. Oh my god, what? Don't help, don't help. Relax, just lay there, okay? What does that feel like? Wow, amazing. Amazing? <laughs> yeah. Why is it amazing? Painful and a little bit painful, uh -huh. but that's okay. <laughs> but what is it amazing? Just the noise? Just the difference? The difference, yeah. Gotcha, okay. Yeah. Come over here. Don't twist, don't turn. Mm -hmm. Okay. You gotta relax, please, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, so when you get up in a minute, you are gonna wanna twist and turn. Do not twist or turn. Just keep your body looking forward, keep your arms at your side. The more you twist and turn, the more you're gonna undo my work. Okay? It's gonna be very difficult for you, but you gotta focus on it. Mm -hmm. Relax. Good. Good. Okay, you ready? Ready. Right. Right there. Hand, please. Go and sit up. Just sit on the table. Relax, nice and relaxed, okay? Okay, are you lightheaded at all, dizzy at all? No. No? Because you're going to walk in a second. Do not twist or turn when you go down the hall. Okay? okay. Keep your arms at your side. Look straight ahead. Do not look at the ground. Straight ahead. That's all I want you to think about. Okay? Go ahead and walk, please. Don't look at the ground. Straight ahead. You stop here, go back to the door. Don't look at the ground. Okay, you lightheaded at all? Dizzy at all? No. Okay, stop right here. Okay, don't move. Stop right here. Don't move. Before we say anything, how do you feel different? A lot of different. Uh, what's a lot of difference? Different, I, I didn't feel my pain on, the, on my shoulders. Maybe a little bit. A little bit, okay. My neck. Just be honest. Yeah. Don't okay. trust him, don't trust him words. Yeah. So that feels different. Yeah. Okay, so let's go through those range of motion you did in there and see how you feel, okay? Knees straight, go slow, not fast. Touch your toes. What's the difference there? It was a five out of 10 in there, what is it now? Same. Same? No, 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 same oh. like two or one. Two or one? Yeah. So did I touch your back? No. Did I rub your back? No. Did I stretch your back? No. What did I touch? I just touched your neck. Yeah, okay. Neck. And your back feels better, right? Right. Good. Are you lying to the camera for me? No, 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 no. Am I paying you to say this? No. Okay, because people always ask me how I'm paying. Okay, so go ahead and go back. That was more pain before. And how much, what does that feel like? Less pain. Less pain. Stand up. Don't, cry. Don't go crazy. Don't go crazy. Okay. Um, how much? One or two or three or what? Oh, yeah. uh, I got like two. Like two, two. two. Okay, yeah. two. Okay, so look at the floor with your neck. What the floor? Now you had pain there. Four, you said a four, how is that now? Less. Less, look at the ceiling. And that's less too, right? Less. Good, look straight ahead. So anything else you want to say that you feel different? No, I feel, I feel amazing. You feel amazing? Amazing, yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah. So Luis, thank you for coming that thank far. You. We're gonna work on you some more. I'm gonna to talk to you off camera, but thank you for the, letting us do the video, okay? Right, thank you. Thank you for watching, guys. Good. Dr. Thayer here. Uh, we're doing a video today on Luis. Uh, we already had one day on him the first day, but we missed a little bit of the footage, so we're going to repeat some of the stuff. Uh, Luis, you came in because of 10 years of low back pain. Right. Tell us why you're here. Well, it's because I come here because I have uh, sleep problems. I have kind of an anxiety thing in my lower back and my shoulder blades. 
Shoulder blade pains. And my calves. Gotcha, and your calves. Yeah. So uh, you had 10 years of low back pain, and you never really went to a chiropractor before for that. No. And it's been going on and off, but really you're here not because of the back pain. Even though it's hurt, mm -hmm. you're here because of anxiety. Anxiety. How long have you had the anxiety? Well, now I have for two months, but two this months. has happened like uh, last, last uh, 10 years. Last 10, you have anxiety three times or something, yeah, a couple times, right? Yeah, yeah. But he's had it for the last two months, two months. so that's why he's really here, because he's really kind of at his wit's end about this anxiety. Exactly. And the sleep problems, You how many times you wake up at night? Uh, I sleep like two hours, that's and right. I wake up. <laughs> he wakes up all the time. All the time. He sleeps about two hours. Two hours. And so uh, that's not very much. And so mm -hmm. that lack of sleep is causing this anxiety. Okay, next. Um, you have pain in your neck. But, yeah. Show us where. Right here. Right have there. The heart pain. Gotcha. Like, and then you have headaches, how often? Head, like uh, twice, a day, twice, twice a week. Gotcha, dizziness once a month, you said. Yeah. Right ear, and this was an interesting thing. What's wrong with your right ear? Oh, my brother kicked me about 30 years ago, and I still hear a little bit noise. <laughs> <laughs> and so he had tinnitus for the last 30 years plus, uh, because his brother kicked him that long ago, and this could have been the smoking gun that may have started it all back then. So right. that was interesting to me, okay? Uh, some forearm pain, pain in your arm a little bit. Yeah, my mom's arm right here. This part right here. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. And uh, the other thing too is you work in construction. Construction, I hang in drywall and taping and painting. And that probably doesn't hurt my neck more. Because when does it hurt? When you look up a lot, look right? Up, look up at the ceiling. And so drywallers and painters who paint a lot, and right. yeah, yeah, that hurts your neck. So mm -hmm. that's a bad one, guys. Okay, so we're going to get him treated again. Uh, he's already been treated once. And so he's going to tell us how he did after the first treatment. I treated you when? What day? Two days uh, ago? Wednesday. Wednesday. Today's Friday. So it's yeah. two days ago. Um, he got adjusted, he was a little scared of it, it went good. Yeah. He didn't feel a lot at first, he told me. So tell us tell us what happened, because you were just telling me. Well, after the first stream, I feel better. I mean, very, very good. Uh, they say like uh, 70 and 80% better. And um, I, I didn't even know that that much. Even that, the first time, I, I, I didn't talk too much because, I don't know, I don't feel like, uh, you know, like right now, I feel better. <laughs> I, can, I can talk now. <laughs> like that. No? So, um, he was telling me a few minutes ago that he didn't feel great at first. And right. you went home talking to your wife and you said, ah, I feel okay. And I, he goes, I had a little anxiety after the adjustment, right? Right, right. You said that. And then you said you slept. What happened after you slept? You slept the best? Oh, yeah, yeah. I slept like probably six hours in a row. <laughs> and when's the last time you slept that long? That six hours? Yeah, when you did? Two, two months ago. Two months ago. And so <laughs> how do you feel after that night's sleep? How did your anxiety feel the next day? Oh, they... they um they probably gone out completely, probably, but sometimes I get tense and comes back, I guess, a little bit. But not nearly as much, right? Not as much. Okay, so he still has some pain, he has some yeah. issues, you know, he's kind of complaining a little bit because he's like not completely gone, I told him not God, it takes me a little longer, all that kind of stuff, but we're going to treat, treat him again today, we're going to show him his x-rays, you guys get to watch, okay? Thank you very much for telling us that, let's get checking out. Okay, come over here. So are you going to stand right there for me, please? Um... So here is your spine, Luis. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so I told you the other day that we want to see a straighter spine, right? right. The straighter the better. The more that you have a lean, the more leverage is created on your back, right? right? Okay, so here's the middle of your back right here. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> if you look up here, here's the middle where your back, your head should be, and your head is completely lean to the right. 20 right. millimeters. So it's leaning all this space. So the, nut, the most important thing I have to tell you is that your body is leveraging itself out of a line. Okay. It's been doing a long time, and that's why you feel the pain you feel, that's why you're here, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. Now, also, I've made marks on here. All these are pinched nerves, and those pinched nerves are, are places of weakness in your back. So this leverage exerts itself on these weaknesses. Okay. Okay, so there are pinched nerves, but really the number one thing is that this balances off. Right. Okay? I can see it right there. Huh? I can't see it right there. You can see it right there, right? Okay, so, um, so everybody else out there, I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. You also have some rib calcification here along the side, just on the ends of the tips. That tells me his low back pain has been there for a long time because this only builds up when he doesn't move a lot. Lack of motion creates this uh, um, calcification. Okay, uh, any questions about that? Pretty straightforward. That's fine. Good. So uh, here's your side view. <clears throat> your side view should look like this. Okay, mm -hmm. I'm gonna lay this over yours. You tell me what looks different. Here's your neck, here's your back. So does it look like this one? No, right? So I'm gonna make the spine look like yours. Okay, I'm gonna bring this forward like this. Okay, so it puts a tremendous amount of pressure on the front of your bones. Right. So you have arthritis all through the front of these bones in here. Mm -hmm. And arthritis is long-standing pinched nerves. 
long standing pressure, abnormal pressure in your spine. So this is all wearing out. You can see the arthritis pretty prevalent here. You even have a little hook right here, and that's located right about T9 in that area, okay? Yeah, where your pain is, exactly. And that's because of this all the, all the time, okay? Okay. So the neck is way out in front of where it's supposed to be. I have a close-up view of this. Um, but again, your posture is terrible. And that's, this balances off, the posture's off, that causes sleep problems, it causes all your pain. Okay. Any questions about that view? No. Okay, let's take a look at your neck. So this is a hard one to see, guys, so sorry about this. Um, this is not you. You're not Julio. Uh, the x-ray is coming right up. Um, let me go grab it. Perfect. Here it is. <laughs> Wrong one. So this is yours. Okay. Okay. So can you see that on the X-ray? Can you see that, Michael? You don't go too close because it's going to be too bright. But anyways, the most important thing here is this: is that the neck should look like this. Okay. And as you can see, it goes sort of turns right here, and then it goes in reverse curve right here at C two C four. Okay. And so that's a very unusual um, presentation. Usually you'll see it look like this more. Mm -hmm. And that means that C4, C6 is usually a reverse curve, but yours is higher. And what does that mean? Well, when this curve, it goes the wrong way, it pushes on this atlas, which is the bone right here. Okay. And that atlas should be at this angle right here. Okay. You can see the angle's off? Mm -hmm. And then it puts abnormal pressure on the back of this, on the back of this tubercle, which puts pressure on your brainstem. Okay. And that's why your balance is all off, okay? Now it's been there long enough where you start to see a hook grow out of the back of your head here, mm -hmm. and that's calcification of that muscle that's starting to happen right in the back of your head right here. Okay. Oh, okay. And so that's only because your posture's been so bad for so long. Oh, okay. So what I need to do, and what I did for you the other day, is I adjusted this area right here, pushing this forward, allowing your atlas to fall in the right spot. Okay. Okay. And that's why your balance got better and you slept better. Okay. Mm -hmm. Any question about that? No. Good. <laughs> You're easy. Have a seat. Okay. So, we're going to talk about uh, how to fix this, okay? okay. Um, have you ever had braces on your teeth before? No. Braces? You know people who have braces, right? Mm -hmm. How long do they wear them for? Probably months. <laughs> months, right? Usually it's years. Okay. But have you heard of a thing called a retainer? You know what a retainer is? No, no, no you don't. Know. Okay. So, if you put braces on your teeth and take them off, do they usually stay where they put them? Not necessarily. They start to move back unless you wear this retainer, okay? And the retainer, we call, we call that idea muscle memory. Your body does not want to stay where you put it. It wants to go back. So you felt pretty good from the first adjustment, right? Mm -hmm. And as the days go by, you kind of go, huh, I, I'm starting to get tight again. The pain's starting to come back again. Mm -hmm. And that's because of muscle memory. Mm -hmm. Do you follow that a little yes. bit? Yes. Good, good, good. Okay, so uh, we're going to talk about how to fix muscle memory. So we use the analogy of exercise. Have you ever gone to the gym before? Uh, no. Never gone to the gym? No. Uh, have you ever worked out? Run? <coughs> have you ever run? Mm -hmm. When you run once a month, how does that feel? Feels okay, right? Yeah, I feel better. What about when you run stronger. once a week? Once a week, uh, better. And what about twice a week? Much better. See? Feels so, stronger. Exactly. Yeah. So this chiropractic works the same way. If you come more often, mm -hmm. you're going to get more out of it. If right. you come less often, you get less out of it. Yes. So it's an energy sum game. Does that make sense to you a little yes. bit? Mm -hmm. So we call that muscle memory. So the thing you do when you come here is I adjust you, you feel better. Then you have to keep coming back so I train your body to be better. To be better. That sort of makes sense? Yes. Okay, just like exercise, okay. Mm -hmm. Any questions about any of that? No. Good, so let's get you treated again here. Um, you're going to uh, stand over there and touch your toes, please. Any pain in your back there? A little bit. A little bit? Mm -hmm. What is this, four or five or three or six? Three. Three, three? okay. Go ahead and go back. Pain there at all? Yeah, just stay in the middle. Three or four or what? Yeah, four or four. Yeah, three or four. Three or four, okay. Mm -hmm. Look at the floor, please. Pain there on your neck? Uh, not too much. Good, look at the ceiling. On the ceiling, yeah, I had a pain. Where? Uh, right here. Right there. And what is that, three or four or what? Five. Five, okay. Lay your back, please. Two shots? Uh, leave them on, that's fine. Scoot down a little bit. Okay. Okay, so you've already done this once, so you're ready for this, okay? Just relax the best you can, okay? Mm -hmm. 
So just like I showed you guys on this x-rays right here, I'm gonna adjust right here in the middle of his neck. Right there, painful? Mm-hmm. Relaxing. Good. You okay? Not as scary as the other day? No. Good. <laughs> So, uh, just like yesterday, or just like on Wednesday, you're going to get up, mm -hmm. and no twisting or turning, right? Right. Okay. Yeah, I can't believe how much better your eyes look. Oh. You don't look nearly as tired. Me either. <laughs> feel better. Feel better? Yeah. Okay, stay right there. Mm -hmm. Let's open the door behind you. Okay, uh, lightheaded at all? No. Good. So, let's go ahead and walk, please. I like those shocks. The other thing I like that you're doing better today, stop right here and go back again, is that um, you're not as nervous as you were the other day. No. You know how you were like, uh, 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 Yeah, because uh, uh. I want to wake up. Once so you do the first adjustment, I want to, you know, lift. <laughs> yeah, you wanted, he wanted to do all this stuff to last the first adjustment. And <laughs> the, thing I, the, the thing I told him that the thing that's going to get in his way is his nervousness. And that was part of the anxiety. So the anxiety was getting in the way of him being helped. So. He's much more calm today. Right. Much more calm. Yes. Good. So let's try to touch your toes real quick. Good. Uh, how's it feel? You said you were uh, three to four. Uh, what is it now? Two. Two. So it's better than it was. Okay, yeah. look at the floor with your neck. Look at the ceiling. This. Two. Two. Okay, two. <laughs> Whatever, two. Yeah. So, um... Good thing is that you've seen him get adjusted. Um, he already has had good results. Um, we're really happy with his progress. His anxiety is much less. His, his sleep is much better. Exactly. His pain is less. But the most important thing he came in for is his anxiety, which we're helping him a lot with. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much for the video. Thank you. And uh, we'll talk more. Good. Right. See you guys. Luis. Uh, you have been here one, two, three, four, about six times, right? Mm -hmm. And you came in for anxiety. Anxiety. Really, the anxiety was the big one. Couldn't sleep. Uh, some uh, low back pain. Weak calves. Tell us what. How are you feeling? Well, this time the six times already come. I feel a lot better. Like I say, eighty percent better. About the anxiety things, I say they go away completely. And um, how long did you have the anxiety for? Ooh, for maybe last three months. Three months, <laughs> and really bad anxiety, right? Really bad anxiety. I can't sleep. I sleep like a one hour, and I wake up just like that. And the next day, and the next day, and, and the next day, day. And next day, and next day. And then the anxiety every day. Yeah. Hard to work. Hard to work. Yes. Hard to sleep. Yes. And after this six times, I come already with you. Um, sleep much better. Good. Just a little bit. I mean, and my night pain and all yeah, that. Yeah, time, yeah, yeah. But sleeping more consistently better. Yes, yes, yes. definitely. And um, did I do any? What did I do on you? What have I done? You tie on me as yes, uh, just my neck. <laughs> have I adjusted your back at all? Any place else? Not your yet. arms? No, no. Your no. legs? No. Have yes. I given you any medication? Any medication? Nothing, nothing, nothing. No. What did I only do? Only adjusted your neck. You only adjust my neck. And you were a little sketchy there for a while. You didn't know if it was going to work, huh? Yes. And how, how do you feel now? A lot better. A lot of better. Yeah. Well, thank you for letting me uh, work on you. We'll keep continue to work on you and get you better, okay? Right. Right Thank you. Good.